Hi everybody, it's Gina and I'm back with another video and this one is about a simple art therapy technique that you can do to reduce stress. So many of you might have seen previous videos in which I'm creating art. I am an artist and I was um, an art teacher for many, many years. I taught at a local private school for, for 11 years, teaching junior high art, um, an advanced eighth grade um, art class as well, in addition to high school sculpture. Prior to that, I also did several, there are several areas within the county where I was also doing like art therapy workshops. So I, w I spent about six years where I worked within the juvenile detention center, um, working with the kids there to create a therapeutic art. Uh, and there is actually an art exhibit that has been traveling throughout the state of Florida of work that were created by my students within that program. So the technique that I'm going to share with you today is a simple, what I like to call, scribbles into art. What you're going to do first is to turn on some music. Nothing too fast, just something that's going to get you kind of in a meditative state of mind. You're going to get a piece of paper, uh, doesn't, have, doesn't matter what it is, if all you have is lined paper, then use that. And you'll have a, you need a pencil or a marker or a pen. And all you're going to do is simply place your pencil or your choice of pen or mark or whatever the case is onto the sheet of paper and you're going to close your eyes while the music is playing you're simply going to allow that pen or marker to simply flow on the paper you're going to be moving it and you're simply going to be drawing a continuous line for maybe 20 to 30 seconds after that time has elapsed then you're going to open your eyes and you're going to take a look at it and um, I'm going to show you the video later on it's of course sped up for the purposes of the video but the time it actually took me to complete this was about an hour and 10 minutes so you can do it the way that I did it or you can simply start looking at the drawing that you have and trying to see what the drawing is trying to tell you but what I like to do is to start coloring and sometimes by adding the color then forms start to to come forth and what is what this is going to do is you'll notice that you start to get really relaxed your whatever if you had any stress prior to that it's it's vanishing because this is, is a really good stress reducing technique and it's also going to encourage creativity so you it's going to teach you kind of how to see um this is not a piece that is um that you're going to worry about the outcome because this is all about the process the creative process not necessarily the final outcome you may not necessarily like some like the way it turns out but it's the process of reducing stress and just allowing you to see what the particular drawing might be trying to tell you all right so don't worry about the final result focus on the process you also don't need to be an artist to do this like I said, all you need is a sheet of paper, pencil. If you want to have some colored pencils, those are great. I happen to use watercolor pencils, which uh, I used as colored pencils first, and then I added water to give it a watercolor effect. Um, but you, if, if crayons are all that you have, work with crayons. Or if you want to go out and get some colored pencils or some paints, um, you can do that as well. So don't rely on the final product. Just uh, work with what you have and just work, worry about the process. Because this is all about the process and reducing stress. Because the last thing you want to do is to do an art therapy assignment that's going to make you stressful. Okay? So um, what I want you to do is just watch the video that I'm going to show you after this. It is sped up for purposes of this, but it, the actual... Um, process took about an hour and 10 minutes for me and uh, but it is sped up to be about nine minutes but you'll still be able to see the entire thing and you'll be able to see how I developed it from the simple line drawing into the final piece now this is not one of my greatest works let me go ahead and share it with you this is the piece that I did 
and it literally came out of all of these lines and you'll see how it was developed as you go through the video so it's you know, you you probably end up with something that you really love uh, but it's like I said it's not about the the final result it is actually about the process and teaching you how to see and reducing stress what I'm also going to show you at the end of the video are a few examples that were done by my students while I was teaching them because I use this during exam periods when they would be doing you know exams in other classes and I knew that they would be the stress level is a little higher than usual so I always included this particular um, exercise during the time that I knew that the students were experiencing higher levels of stress for example during exam periods so I'm going to show you a few of the examples that they got now this is not something that you can duplicate um, every, if you do this 10 times you're going to end up with 10 different results that's the beauty of this um, so if you wanted to try it again you can do that but I'm also going to be sharing with you other techniques um, I'm going to try to create like a little series and show you different techniques that you can do to help you to reduce stress.